Revelation chapter number 11 verse number 14 the second woe is past and the third woe cometh quickly we are in the 11th chapter of the book of Revelation and we are down to verse number 14 and verse number 14 sums up where we are in respect to the three woes the deadly three woes the fifth trumpet was the first woe then we come down sixth trumpet contained the second woe then the scriptures tell us now the third woe cometh quickly the third and final woe now the scriptures does not give us an exact verse as to when the third woe ended but verse 14 states that after this then the third woe will begin the third woe more than likely is the deadliest of all the woes the third woe most likely is the most terrible of all the three woes since the scripture does not give us any concrete verse chapter at when the third woe we are suggesting that the third woe are the final seven last plagues themselves some writings call them the seven bowls or seven vials because when we get into that starting with chapter number 15 where well, the angels will be pouring out their vials and this will be the concluding of the series of sevens in the Bible the book of Revelation we started with the seven churches then we moved on to the seven seals then we moved on to the seven trumpets it talked briefly about the seven thunders but then we're going to move to the final set of sevens in the book of revelation the seven last plagues incredibly terrible we would read things in the last seven plagues that has not happened nor will ever happen again things that would be so incredibly deadly but at this time there won't be any of God's righteous going through those by this time God righteous would be gone you do not have to go through any of those if you are not saved or do not have the Lord as your personal savior you can ask him to forgive you right now and to wash you and clean you and he is faithful to do just that and ask him to help you live a life where you can stop sinning and serve him God in the name of Jesus we ask you to look on and bless and have your way give strength give courage draw souls to you that men and women do not have to go through this terrible terrible time in Jesus name thank God amen have a great day